hundreds of millions of dollars will be given away this weekend as the winning ticket for Powerball and the Mega Millions still up for grabs. CBS 12's Madeline Montgomery shows us what a lottery lawyer says you should do with that money if you're lucky enough to win it. A lot of people are coming out and buying these, hoping to become a multimillionaire, but winning the lottery isn't as simple as just picking up a giant check. What would you do if you won the lottery? I'm going to buy a big piece of property. A lot of people are dreaming up what to do with their winnings as the Mega Millions and Powerball prizes climb in cost. Buy a house, a boat, travel the world. One man knows exactly what to do if you make bank with the lottery. His name is Kurt Panousis, and he's a lottery lawyer. You know, I did some work in it, dabbled in it from time the time it was no big deal until the 2016 Powerball couple. Panousis's expertise is in wills and estates, but has been helping lottery winners since the 80s. Um, have counseled people in the 200 range, and then what's really taken off here in Florida is a lot of these scratch offs. Recent winner Panousis represented won $15 million in Stewart. Uh, they actually had to go on unemployment for a period of time, and so they came down to help family members. And during that process, you know, continue to play the lottery. And of course, you know, God blesses some people sometimes. While winners are obviously very lucky, they're usually not aware of some obstacles that come with a giant check. And who do you tell and who do you and how how do you keep it you know, as close to the best as possible. Winners have to choose if they want to lump some of their win at a reduced rate or if they want to pay out over 30 years. I generally recommend a a outright cash lump sum. That way the person has control of their money. There are also lots of taxes involved with a big win. Even giving money to family members is taxed as a gift. But giving is what a lot of people want to do when they win. A lot of it would go to charity. You know, they all have these dreams of, of charities and things like that. Of course, winners buy fun stuff too. I mean, people buy vehicles, obviously. I've had a client that bought a boat right away. Um, some people will upgrade their houses. Panousis does advise people wait to make any big purchases. Settle in and the money's in the bank and it's invested. Let's take a look at those things that you need to buy and put the other things off for six months. Being surrounded by so much luck, Panousis hopes some of it rubs off on him one day. Thanks. You'll never win if you don't play. The Mega Millions prize is estimated to be $750 million. Powerball is estimated to be $640 million. From Juno Beach, Madeline Montgomery, CBS 12 News.